the numbers on Felipe Paulino. He's worked 10 times, seven times as a starter, one and four with a 6.21 ERA. Ian Snell, right-hander, has struggled this year for the Pirates. He's one and six with a 5.64 ERA. A lot of traffic in 59 innings. Major League debut Thursday, two for four with an RBI, three runs, and a stolen base. And now he singles to left center field to open this game. Strike and Morgan is caught looking. He's just staring at Larry Vanover who called him out on strikes for out number one. And the high one gets him on strikes. Two strikeouts in the first inning for Paulino. It's on base average. Smacks one into center field. He follows suit with McCutcheon. Hits the ball in almost exactly the same spot. Lead off singles for both teams in the first inning. Bouncer third. There's the play to second for one from Andy LaRoche and on to Adam LaRoche. But that slider was a good one and he gets a double play and a strikeout in the first. No score. And those three runs second and third innings last night. That one's a line drive to right field. He didn't try to do a whole lot with it and winds up with a single to the opposite field. Cargo. Runner going. That one's hit to left center field. That's a gapper. And the Pirates will take a one nothing lead. Andy LaRoche will score easily on the RBI double by Hotamio. That's his 10th double of the year, RBI number 14. And there's a physical problem here. Head athletic trainer Nate Lucero has been called out to the mound. With Paulino hurting. Looks like he was grabbing at the right groin area. I don't know if he's going to be able to continue here or not. He looks the coop walking off. I don't know if he's going to take him with him. Yeah, it looks like he is. Cautious Tough approach. Break. Lee's going into swing and a miss. Hotamio's throw and the tag by Vasquez. Oh, no. I, I'm kind of with you, El Caballo. I think he beat it. Up on this homestand. Line shot, right field. Headed for the corner and extra bases. Blum into second with a two out double, of course, after the caught stealing. Mm -hmm. That's a given. That's a sixth double of the year. Yeah. In the center field. Blum is coming home. McCutcheon with a throw to the plate. It's offline, and Blum is able to score the tying run. Fly ball. Brandon Moss in right. Handles the third out. Rejoin the Astros. Then a couple tough decisions will have to be made. Yeah, you're right. Roller out to Tejada. Russ Ortiz has a one, two, three, third. Ground ball up the middle. Diving play. Vasquez get the, to Sanchez and on to first. Spectacular double play. That's three double plays in three innings. He does, but it's caught in the air. Yeah. And Blom throws to second and the Justice head is, is served. <laughs> you get your line drive double play from Blom to Kepinger. Off the line here, fair ball. Kepinger is moving to second base. Brandon Moss plays it, and his throw is offline. A double for Kepinger. He's two for two. Really short. Well, he's going to get deeper. A catching way back into center field. That is in for extra bases. It stays in play. Kepinger will score the go-ahead run on a double by Quintero. That'll back him up. Second double of the season for Q. That's RBI number seven. Fly ball to left. Nigel Morgan waiting. And in the fifth inning, the Astros settle for one run, two hits. Broken bat. Ortiz over. Tossing to Berkman. He puts up another zero. Grounder. Uh, what a play by Andy LaRoche. Going to Adam and robbing Miggy Tejada. Diving to his left. Andy LaRoche turns in a beauty. Pence takes a one out walk. Pence is going. Here's a throw from Jaramillo. It bounces and he steals it. In the right field. Hunter around third. Moss with a throw to the plate. Jaramillo will not get him. Carlos trapped between first and second. And here's the throw to Sanchez and back to Vasquez for the out. RBI single for Carlos Lee. 
That's in the right field. A pinch single. Tony Beasley throws up a stop sign at third. The bases are loaded. Chop to the right side. Berkman tossing to Fulcino. Gets the out as the run scores to make it three to two. McCutcheon getting an RBI. Line drive will create the tying run. Scoring and a throw in and now into second base after the RBI single goes Morgan. Very late swing. Bouncer first. Berkman comes home for the force play. Quintero back to first to Berkman. Roll to second. Sanchez gets one. Vasquez up. No double play. Warren takes a four pitch walk. First and second now. Two out for Tejada. All four of duty. That's a short stop. Vasquez flips to second. Safe. Here comes the go ahead run. Matt Cato scores from second base on the play. Horton smacks the line drive to right. A single getting Erstad to second base. Berkman two for four in this game. In the right center field, Erstad will score to make it 5 3. RBI single, Quintero, his third straight hit. Up the right field line toward the corner, could be extra bases for Michaels. And he does hit a fair ball, scoring Berkman and a double. As it pops out of play, pinch RBI double for Jason Michaels makes it six to three Houston. Direct three. Chop slowly to second. Bare hand play by Kevin to safe at first. No stolen base there. There's one to the right side. A foul pop for Buckman to end it. And Hawkins with save number eight. The Astros have knocked off the Pirates six to four. They have beaten them for the fifth straight series.